Hi guys, welcome back today. Okay, so I have something super exciting to share with you. And um, I have really, I've been waiting for this for, I don't know, I'd say about two weeks. I've, I noticed it and I got an email about it. So um, I just wanted to share with you guys the new Too Faced Peaches and Cream collection that is going to be released on September 1st. So I'm filming this on August 30th. And so in two days, um, you're gonna be able to get your hands on all of these products. And I am super excited to share them with you today. Now, if you clicked on this video, hoping to see uh, the products, I do not have the products. Um, I'm just like everybody else out there that's waiting to um, get them on September 1st. Uh, so if you don't, you know, like that, then you are more than welcome to click off this video and stop watching. But if you want to hear my thoughts and um, what's coming in the collection on Friday, then just keep watching. Okay, so Too Faced has um, quite a few things. I'm looking down at my phone so that um, we can kind of go through them together. And um, I'm going to insert pictures and everything so that you guys can see them kind of close up. But the thing that I'm most excited about in this collection is the Just Peachy Mattes palette. And it's gonna retail for $45. And it's described on Too Faced's website as velvet matte eyeshadow palette infused with peach and sweet fig cream. Now, before I really get into it, if you don't know, um, Too Faced has like a peach collection. Like they came out with uh, the, the Sweet Peach palette, they came out with a couple of blushes, some lip glosses, I think. I don't have the uh, Sweet Peach palette. I don't have any Too Faced palettes, as a matter of fact. But this is one, the Just Peachy Mattes, is one I'm going to purchase because the colors are stunning. But um, anyway, so they have this collection and um, they're adding to it with the peaches and cream. And everything in the collection smells like peaches. So I think that is, that's super cool. You know how they have like their Soleil bronzer, their chocolate Soleil bronzer, their chocolate bar palette, all of those things that smell like chocolate. Well, these smell like peaches. Okay, so the palette has 12 shades. Obviously they are all matte, hence the name. And it's warm tones, gorgeous warm tones, pinks, um, obviously uh, the peach tones, pinks, they've got a gorgeous cranberry that I am just loving called peach sangria. Um, the one that's called just ripe looks gorgeous. Peach sangria doesn't look quite as matte in the picture. It looks more like it has some kind of a sheen to it. I'm not really sure. I mean, obviously they say it's a matte palette. But I mean, we'll, we shall see. And then you've got, you know, a, a lot of great transition shades. And then you have a few dark shades that you could use to really, a few dark shades that you could use to really, you know, darken up that outer V if you wanted to. So anyway, this is one that I'm definitely going to be purchasing. I cannot wait. This is the one thing that I have really looked at and that I really want to purchase. And then possibly one other thing that I'll talk about in just a minute. Okay, the next thing they um, have on the website are their matte lipsticks, and they describe it as a moisture matte, long-wearing lipstick infused with peach and sweet fig cream. Again, um, it looks like there are quite a few shades. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 20 shades, and they range, I mean, they've got some deep purples, uh, a, a, looks like a really, really dark wine color, reds, um, your Barbie pinks, and a, a huge shade variety of, I think, nudes. So those are just, and the packaging, you guys, look at the packaging on this. Isn't it stunning? Like, yes, okay, looks super fancy. So those are all going to retail for $21 a piece, and those look great, in my opinion. Um, I think, I mean, 21 bucks, if you're paying for high end, you're paying for packaging, you're paying for Too Faced. So, I mean, obviously, you're not really going to get away with that. Um, okay, so the next thing they have on their website to be released is the Sweetie Pie Bronzer. And this retails for $30. It says it's a radiant matte bronzer infused with peach and sweet fig cream, again. 
and it looks like there's only one color but it's not, they say it, this bronzer smells as good as it looks and it features four blendable shades that combine to define highlight and sculpt for a radiant complexion boosting finish that's the perfect recipe for a soft flawless look so that one looks kind of cool I'm, I'm not really into anything like a sheen based um, bronzer i like a matte bronzer just because i'm older but i mean you young girls out there might be able to get your hands on this one okay so next thing they have that i am kind of excited about i'm gonna have to i don't know maybe um do a little more research on it go to a sephora or wherever and test it out but it is the peach perfect foundation and it's a matte foundation and once again, they say it's infused with the peach and sweet fig cream. Um, let's see how many shades, 12 shades. Um, it, it, a lot of them are your, you know, your light tones. So there isn't a very good selection as far as like your deeper skin tones, which is really disappointing. Um, I really wish that more companies would branch out there because they're everybody, you know, there are darker people out there. Hello, help a girl out. So it says that this is a matte, long-wearing, 14-hour formula. The modern way to wear matte foundation, photo-friendly, smooth, flawless, and comfortable with a soft focus, velvety finish. So that's quite, those are some claims there. Oil-free, 14-hour wear, oil-controlling, and photo-friendly, which I think is super important when it comes to stuff. I mean, that to me tells me that there's no SPF in it because it's not going to have a flashback. Um, it smooths for a flawless finish, and they say to apply with fingertips or sponge. You know the drill. Anyway, so 12 shades, and this is going to retail for it's $36. So your basic, you know, price for any kind of high-end foundation like that. The next thing, Peach Blur Finishing Powder. I'm kind of excited about this. I, I like finishing powders, like the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette is like... I love it. It's so, it's, it's just, it really creates a filtered look on your face. And I, so I love finishing powders. But the interesting thing about this one is they say it's a translucent, it's a translucent smoothing finishing powder. I, it's translucent. But um, I'll insert the picture so you guys can see it. It says peach blur is the most magical all over finishing powder ever created. <laughs> Achieve the illusion of perfect skin with advanced optical correcting spheres that help smooth harsh lines and blur imperfections in a translucent peach shade that works on all skin tones. <clears throat> so, I don't know. This one is going to read, this powder is going to retail for $30. It's kind of high for a powder. But, I mean, if you like those finishing powders or those blur powders or like the ambient lighting powders from hourglass or you know and i i i think you should you you know you could give this one a try i'm sure that it will be stunning now i obviously recommend before purchasing anything to go into a sephora go into an ulta you know wherever you can get your hands on testers and really try it out because i mean obviously you can return anything but i that's just something that i would recommend for you guys okay so let's move on let's see um they have a primed and peachy primer interesting this is going to retail for 30 dollars says it's a cooling matte perfecting primer all right refreshing peach and sweet fig cream is infused in our long-lasting cooling matte primer that blurs and smooths your complexion with a brightening peach tint that works on any skin tone so, wear alone or under foundation for mattifying soft focus finish that's lightweight, comfortable, and smells as good as it feels. Okay, so it's basically a primer. I mean, it says it's got 16 hour plus long wear, 12 hours of shine control. It's got a mattifying finish, which is important for some women. Um, I, I like a mattifying primer. I think it helps even if you don't wear a matte foundation. It's going to keep, you know, if you have oil issues, that's a really, really, really good thing. And it says it's lightweight, comfortable wear. Blurs, blurs, smooths, and brightens complexion. So basically what you're looking for in a great 
primer, right? And this is gonna retail for $30. All right, let's move on to some cheap products, shall we? Um, bronzed peach, this is a bronzer. Melting powder bronzer infused with peach and sweet fig cream, obviously. It looks like it comes in one shade. Get a bronzed peachy glow or add dimension in a totally new way with the first of its kind melting powder bronzer. So I guess it's supposed to melt into your skin. The total sensorial experience begins as soon as the formula is touched. <laughs> That's interesting. The creamy buttery texture instantly transforms into a lightweight powder once applied. It has a buildable finish that is soft, blendable, and leaves you looking feeling and smelling like dreamy peaches and cream. So that bronzer is going to retail for, in the packaging cute, the bronzer is gonna retail for $30. Okay, so peach, my cheeks blush. So they have blushes coming out, melting powder blush infused with peach and sweet, you know, fig cream. All right, it says give your cheeks a pinch of color with this first of its kind melting powder blush. <clears throat> You know, same thing as with the with the bronzer. The total sensorial experience begins as soon as the formula is touched. So it's a it's a cream it's a it's a cream blush, and it comes in six colors. And some of the colors are oh my gosh, you guys, they're so pretty. Like there's this one color. It's called peach berry. Look how pretty that is. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? Oh my gosh, that it's just amazing and then they have this other color called ginger peach which i think is going to give you i mean that's the, the 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 peach peach that you're going to you know want obviously peach cheeks and then they have this interesting one called spiced peach which looks like it's a brownish plum really really pretty okay so those are thirty dollars a piece and there are six colors of those the peach my cheeks blush that's a hard thing to say all right so moving on to something i think is super interesting that are gonna have a peach perfect mattifying setting powder which it's going to be 32 dollars and it says it's a mattifying loose setting powder it smells like peaches obviously the feather light universal peach tint setting powder Brightens your skin and smells like a dream. Sets your foundation and creates a silky smooth canvas for bronzers, blushes, and highlighters while helping to absorb oil and reduce shine throughout the day. So it's basically, it's your, it's your standard setting powder, but it's got like, I, I know you guys, I don't even know why I'm showing you my phone, um, but I'll insert a picture. Um, it's got a peach tint to it, so I don't know. It says it's mattifying, loose setting powder. Who knows? But that's going to be $32 for that. All right. And then the Peach Frost. I'm assuming, yeah, this is a highlighter. It's $30 for the highlighter and it's just one shade. And it says, illuminate the skin with this, with the first of its kind melting powder highlighter in the perfect champagne peach shade. So creamy buttery texture instantly transforms into a lightweight, you know, powder once applied. So it says it has a buildable finish to the soft. So leaves your cheeks feeling and smelling like a dream again. There you go with that peach color. Okay, so you're gonna be able to get this one. Obviously it's a highlighter, so it's gonna have a sheen to it, I'm assuming. And this one's gonna be $30. So for all you highlight girls out there, there you go. Something that smells like peach looks, you know, and it's a highlighter. Okay. So, very last thing I wanna share with you guys is the Peach Mist Mattifying Setting Spray. Um, this refreshing peach and sweet fig cream infused setting spray locks down makeup with our exclusive comfort matte finish and helps control oil for comfortable weightless feel that lasts all day. So, it's a setting spray that smells like peaches. I, how can, you know, yeah. And you're gonna um, pay $30, but it's mattifying. So what I'm starting to notice, and, and that's everything in the collection that they're coming out with. So what I'm noticing is there's a lot of matte qualities and then they're doing cream products. So the Just PG Mattes palette, that hands down, I, I will be at my Sephora or my Ulta purchasing that, um, that palette. Anyways, um, if this is something you guys like enjoy me doing because I'm constantly researching new products Like I said, I knew this was coming out like weeks ago 
and I just wanted to go ahead and film this video for anybody who didn't know and um, may want to, you know, get their hands on some peach smell and makeup. Um, so if this is something you guys like, I know that I don't have the products. I'm sure a lot of people are going to be about it, but whatever. I don't care. Um, but if this is something you guys like that I'm doing, that I'm kind of giving you a heads up on a few products that are coming out this week or whatever, let me know and I'll keep doing it and I'll, you know, give you guys a heads up. So you're always in the beauty know. Um, that's what I always try to do. Not just for my channel. I've always done that, but I mean, why not, right? Why not be in the know? So if you guys enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe. And um, I might have some reviews coming soon on these products, whichever ones I decide to purchase. Definitely the palette. I know for sure I'm going to get that. But um, I might do a review on my blog or I might do one here if you guys want to see that. And then I may even do a tutorial using the new palette. So um, I just want to thank you guys for watching and, um, you know, go over and follow my blog and follow me on Instagram and on Twitter. And um, I hope that you guys have a really great day and thanks for watching. Bye guys.